Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Paul Wooten here. Had a good toy show this last weekend on Mother's Day weekend down in Chattanooga, Tennessee. Actually in East Ridge, Tennessee. And uh, was able to score a small um, bin of loose cars like I normally do. Um, there is some goodies in there. Um, there's some beat up cars too, but stick around and we'll show them to you. And I uh, got some Yat Ming and some Tamika and Majorette and a couple Play Arts. Some oddball um, no name cars. A little bit of Hot Wheels, a little bit of Matchbox, a little bit of other um, mixed in. So let's just get right into it. We're going to show you the cars and love them or leave them. I enjoy getting the loose beaters. This is a Twin Mill 2. Of course, you're going to have a few NASCAR cars in there. McDonald's Quaker State. Uh, Donico 51. It's a plastic McDonald's car. Disney, it looks like. I think that's what it is. Pretty cool. Got an old beater matchbox. Everybody's got a few of these cattle trucks. Missing the windshield convertible Mercedes, I think. Yep, Mercedes. Got this nice Corvette. Seen better days, but it still rolls. Got good rolling tires. It's amazing how you find these old cars in dump bins and the wheels are still straight. They still roll. You find some of the newer models in there and they just are no good. The, the axles are much worse nowadays. They're not really built on the last like they did, you know, 50 years ago and 65 years ago. Got a Jeep. I think that's pretty cool. The Red Rider. Everybody's got one of these and missing a motor. That's okay. I got quite a few I could swap around. This bank truck. I think everybody's got this bank truck. I think they made more of this bank truck than they probably have of uh, about any matchbox. And uh, some of the tampos are still on there. We got a uh, Majorette Indy RL car. Color Changer 57 Chevy. Large Charge. Um, color changer wheels black wall wheels great shape still these things chipped real bad they had paint as thick as molasses on them <clears throat> this is a Acura a newer car matchbox buggy Dune Baja buggy some years on it but still rolls I know beater I'll forget what the name of this is matchbox uh, TVR got a beater highway patrol 67 Camaro got the big rig Bum. The Jester, I think that's from a five pack. It's kind of got the little nuclear tampos on the side with the PR5 yellows. And a Camaro and another Camaro convertible. Black wall Ferrari. Mustang. I don't have this variation in my collection, so even though it's a little bit beat up, it will go in there until I find one that's a little bit better. Uh, Willys. Got this Gator Rod, I think is what it's called. Croc Rod or something like that. Cool for the kids. And Jackson will be able to play with that one. It looks like nothing comes off. Yeah, little man, he's. A little bit over a year and a half now, man. He is running, wanting to start talking. He's getting more and more awesome. Uh, Blackwall Thunderbird color changer. Pretty sweet piece. Wheels are in great condition. Look at the wheels on them things. Very close up there. 
fire truck. Lesney. I forget. Audacious. Yep, Audacious. Soccer theme. Ford Fusion, right? Yep, Ford Fusion police car. I think the, did these come out of Cyril? I have a bunch of them that came out of the Cyril boxes, I think, a while, years ago. And they got that crazy inserted Hot Wheels logo. Well, them logos were fun when you was doing customs on a bunch and you had a bunch that had different bases. This is an oldie but goodie, ultra hot. I forget the name of this guy. Hong Kong Ultra Hots. Uh, tool again. We got the Speed Speed Seeker. Oh, sometimes I forget the names of these guys. Got a uh, Ford High Raker. I do not have this variation, so it was cool to find this or have this in this group of uh, stuff here. A buddy of mine at the show where I normally get this stuff from, he at the end of the show he'll have a huge dump bin and he'll come over and we'll we'll go back and forth and we'll start somewhere and end somewhere and usually get a pretty good deal. Most time I don't even know what's in it. Uh, Lotus got that purple Lincoln. Got a really nice uh, 63 split window Corvette. I think this may be a color changer too. Yeah, I think it is. But the paint on it is real good. The um, tampos are faded, but I think they're pretty faded on all of those. Matchbox Corvette. Pretty nice piece. Still rolls. BMW Z4. Maisto. Got a little beater uh, Viper there. Wheels don't even roll on them. We got, these are not very old. Wheels don't even roll. They're all jacked up. Newer vehicles, man. I don't know what it is. An old uh, T-Bird. God bless the USA. Vampira. Ultra hot. Got a Cars Miati. I guess that's what it is. My Mazda Miati. Days of Thunder. Pretty cool. Missing the front wheel. Already hit the wall. Mellow Yellow. Cold Trickle. The Racing Champions. Got a McDonald's Accelerators. A Hulk. Incredible Hulk. Makes no piece. A Blackwall Jeep missing the windshield. Wheels are a little bit wank there. All they were tough on this Jeep. The front wheels have just come loose. I've got enough of these old beaters that I need roll cages for. Some have good windshield, no roll cages. I'm going to put a few of them together. And uh, But look at the wheel. Look at the wheel on that back wheel right there. Chrome's still almost perfect on that dude. And uh, you're so fast. So that's those move them over to the side over here. Oop, I almost dropped it. Let's put it over here where it don't fall. Alright, so now we got some of the I think the cooler stuff. Um the uh, we got this Ozmobile Majorette. Nice piece. We got this Saab Turbo made in France. Couple Saab turbos. Still got the hitches on the back. Doors open. <laughs> I love finding these little guys. Windshields are in good in good good condition. Excuse me. <laughs> Wheels are nice. Very cool. We've got a uh, Road Champs Ferrari Testarossa. 
rear hatch opens on that showing that big old cool engine this is a color changer doors open I was standing here looking at this the other night, and uh, I knew I had a dark one. And then I was messing around, and I had it in my hand, and I was just holding it like this. And I wasn't thinking nothing about it. And uh, I was showing this uh, Ford Capri to pull back. Pretty cool. So when I pulled it out, I'm like, what happened to the car? It's so much lighter. I didn't realize they made uh, color changers in Road Champs. Has anybody else seen that? I guess it's a road champ. I can't tell the logo is kind of jacked up. But look how wide that base is on that thing. But if you can see the logo right up in that corner right there. Ooh, we got a little bit too too close there. Um, got a Yatming. Uh, Mercedes 450 SEL. Tow hitch, tow hitch on the back. Play art. This says uh, VW Porsche 914. Seen better days. Crack windshield. But man, I like to rescue these things, man. We got this uh, Corgi. It ended up being a Hot Wheel. Very nice. Majorette. This one's in good shape. It's even got a hood ornament on it. Hood ornament. Very cool. Mercedes. Another Yatmin Toyota Crown. Doors open on it. We've got this uh, Yatmin BMW. It's seen better days. The rear wheels are jacked up on it, but and uh, starting to come loose right there. But hey, still pretty cool. Tomika, Tomika BMW 320i maybe, Tomi, made in Japan, doors open on it, another major at Mercedes, whoever had this tote, like the Mercedes, here's another Yatming Mercedes, the tow hitch on it. That's a pretty cool piece. An oddball brand Ferrari 308. I don't know who makes it. It's hard to tell. Doesn't really say. This little cool guy. It's just a generic race car. Needs a little TLC. Might be able to give that to it. So we got this uh, Yatming IRL Indy. I don't know the difference between an IRL car and an Indy car. I don't know enough about that particular style of racing. I know my NASCAR. No, most stock car racing lingo and what have you, but I don't know much about the open wheel stuff. Um, got this uh, Corgi. Really nice. Firebird Corgi. This is in really good shape. Really good shape. I, I was really surprised at how good a shape that little car was in. And I had this really funny thought. Well, let me show you this real quick. Got this. I think this is a uh, Sea Toy. Sea Toy. GWA bus. Needs some wheels on it. And I think that's about it. Oh, we got this one. This is a really rare dinosaur. So we got this Yatmin Jeep. Missing the rear tire. Nah, that's not that big of a deal. But what, what do we have on this Jeep that we hardly ever see? It's got a hood on it. I never knew these things had hoods. Like every one I have in my collection is missing hoods. But it has a hood on it. But it's got these little the cheesy skinny tires on it. Oh, wow. CJ7. <laughs> there you go. 
Well, 15 minutes almost. All right, so I got these uh, road champs. You know, the wheels on them look so much like black walls. So much like black walls. So this Trans Am, Firebird, however you want to put it, T-top. When doors open, pretty nice little piece. Not too bad a shape. And I uh, got the door shut there. And then, then I found this little, uh, what is this? Buick Riviera. <laughs> So we got a Buick Riviera, which is, it, it, it's a convertible, so it doesn't have a top. So I was getting, I was got to thinking about this red car, and I got to thinking about the top being gone, which it's convertible, and it missing a door. A little bit of smoke in the band, it kind of comes to mind. Even though you got a yellow um, Trans Am, and this isn't a police car. But it is a, a Buick Riviera. And uh, I got to thinking about the door being missing. Put the evidence in the car, Junior. <laughs> I just thought that was pretty cool. Kind of reminds you of Cannonball Run or Smoking the Bandit. This old car without the door on it and what have you. Just a weird memory comeback. So that was pretty funny. So uh, there you go. That's a very cool looking... Trans Am Turbo Trans Am it says 1982 on it. This Riviera says 1984. Very cool. That was uh, my uh, misfit toys, if you would say. Thanks for uh, staying to the end. And I'm going to show some other cool stuff that I found. Over the weekend, got this really nice heavy duty trucks 1972 Chevrolet C30 ramp truck and a 1968 Chevy Impala SS. Picked up quite a few of these uh, green light um, pieces, I'll show them in another video. And uh, thumbs up, comment below. If there's anything in this uh, Misfit Toys things you like the most, I know my, my couple favorites were probably these two Firebirds. These Firebirds are pretty nice. This uh, Yat Ming and this Road Champs. In pretty good shape. So uh, I do like the Yat Ming stuff um, and the Tamika car. So uh, make a comment down below. Thumbs up. Share with your friends. Come back and see me. Check out some of my other videos. Never know. Talk to you later.